Hello, hello, beautiful people. Welcome back to a brand new video. And if you guys missed the last videos, I'll leave the playlist on top of the description. Definitely go ahead and check them out. Last episode, we ended it on a bang. So today, I'm just gonna start off by alking all of this extra loot that I have to get some extra money. And uh, I'll quickly show you guys the stats that I have on both accounts. Now, this is my main account that's basically an all around account. And this is my AFK account that is eventually going to transition into a Slayer account. And PVM account. So the stats here 99 strength. I'm one of two people that has that, and obviously working on 99 attack right now, so that's kind of cool. And on this one, as I said, we're gonna be going probably for the fifth relic today. Uh, we're gonna do our best to get a bunch of tasks done. If I claim this, we got a hundred points there, very nice. And uh, but first, we do want to alk all of this, get a bunch of money. We should have money pretty much forever now, so uh, that is very nice because we are no longer broke. That is huge, we just got another Xeric Talisman, but the reason why this is actually huge is because you can do this thing, you can dismantle it, and look at that, a hundred teleports just from that, and now we have 189 charges, that should suffice for a very long time, so very happy with that, and uh, well, I'm still thieving, I need to get to 75. Random event luck is always on our sides, it seems. Hunter is level 27, let's get that a little bit higher. I'm lagging slightly because I am uploading a video, but there we have it. 2k experience and we are now 29 Hunter, very nice. 75 thieving is finally completed and how many charges do we have? We have 234. Five charges on the talisman that's gonna be huge for a very long time and uh, if at any point I need to return I can return I'm gonna just even till I get kicked out finish one farm run and then go ahead and complete that task it's gonna give us a lot of points I think 250 it's gonna be huge and here ladies and gentlemen is why we wasted so many hours on there it is on literally thieving this steal from a gem stall is actually an elite task and, uh, well, compared to others, it is very, very OP, because it is literally the same as getting a 99 in a skill. The ascent of Arceus is now also completed. Scary snake is about to be completed. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck, man? This snake looks so weird, though. And we should be finishing yet another quest. There we go. Here we go. We should finish 20% Shazian, just like that. Nice, let's complete the quest. Tale of the Righteous completed, here we go, 40% favor, perfect, we can now tackle Organized Crime, which I do think is one of the tasks as well. Anyways, here we go, another 100 Golonova fruit for 50,000 XP, actually 48,000 experience, 52 farming, and I think I can now do my, uh, oh, what? Huh, I swear I should have gotten more XP. Uh, I will probably go ahead and get my farming boost now so I can do the next tier of the fruit fuck that's not even that fast actually here we go we made ourselves 10 uh, garden pies I sh oh fuck not on the sink I should be able to not burn them I'm 80 cooking and then we can return to Thai farm and then actually boost and take the next tier seeds it's gonna increase my experience pretty much two times like I get 45k now I should get 90k with the next trip, so that's definitely worth the time um, invested into making them. So here we go, we planted 100 Bologano seeds and we also can use them in the sack. And there it is, 105,000 experience. We got to 58 farming, which means that we didn't get 60. So here we go, I originally wanted to do this from clue scrolls, because you can easily get the rune axe from a hard clue, but I'll just spend 40k, that's very expensive for a rune axe, but you know what, fuck it, it's fine. I'm sure it's okay, we have a lot of money anyways. We now need to make our way to land's end, and search for some uh, traps, and then train um, hunter, and while I'll do it, I'll also pretty much chop oaks, and if I get clue scrolls, they're gonna pop in the inventory, because I bang filled earlier, and on top of that, those oak logs that we end up getting are gonna be used for 99 construction. So we're pretty much doing four or three or four things at the same time, which is awesome. Um, and we also didn't collect the tasks yet, so boom, and we are 1120 left from tier 5 relic. 35 Hunter was just accomplished, and we're gonna do 100% in Pisarilia's favor very quickly. Uh, with hunting the sandworms things, and then we're gonna do aerial fishing. So let's complete 100% here, shouldn't take too long. I think this inventory is going to be it for 100%, perfect. 
we're just gonna fish one anglerfish that's gonna be I think an elite task which is huge and then after that we can go and do aerial fishing until the point where we can catch chins so pretty excited this might take a little bit of time there it is guy wait I guess another task is to f cook it huh Never mind, apparently anglerfish is not a task, which is weird to me, because you need 100% favor to catch them, so it would make sense that it would be an actual task. Well, I guess, I guess, I guess not today. Alright, let's go and do some aerial fishing real quick. The grind for 53 hunter begins right here. This might be a bit of a trouble with that many people, but hopefully we can make it work. Gentlemen, we have done it. 53 hunter, we can now trap chinchompas, which is huge. So that's gonna be our next goal, is probably to go to 60 Hunter just catching chins. And here we go, the strategy I am using, I just put my box traps around shins pretty much. And here we have it, 60 Hunter accomplished, we can now place 4 traps. I have not done too many updates on our Slayer account at the moment. I've just been spamming Soulful Lizards to get nature runes and the stats on the screen are 91 attack and 99 strength. I'm currently working on 99 attack. Wait, I said 99 three times? I don't know. And then after these are both 99, we're gonna go for 99 defense. Here we go, I think I'm gonna end the trip right here. 63 Hunter was accomplished and we have 334 chins. Now what I wanna do before I go throw these is, well, I need to get myself 43 uh, prayer obviously. So I do think I have some insult heads still in the bank. Earlier we were very broke on the account, but now I think we are quite rich. So we can afford to get our prayer level up. I'll use all the insult heads and then we see what prayer we get. And after that we're gonna tackle on the temple spiders. Here we go, that should do it, just one more hit, and we will be 43 prayer. Ah, there it is, finally. Okay, 43 prayer, very important, because now we can protect from melee. Would be even better if I could get 44, but I'm literally out of insult head, so... Fuck. It might really be worth it to go for this, though. Mmm... Uh... Just like that, that was totally worth the extra effort. Now when I go ahead and kill the temple spiders, I'm obviously gonna be flicking and praying melee and eagle eye. Should be a lot of fun, let's gear up and let's kill some spiders. This is gonna be the gear. <laughs> Holy moly, it really it looks ugly. Uh, but I'm just gonna see how much XP we get at the start. I mean, what I really should do is complete some clues, try to get a better amulet and whatnot, but you know what? I'm lazy, so I'm just gonna go like this, see if it works, if it doesn't work, we can always change our route and our plan, but I, I think I like it. A lot of things. Oh, there it is, 40 Slayer coming through, very nice. Nice, 60 range, very nice, that's gonna be pretty nice amount of points. I'm almost out of chins though. I just finished the task, so we got a bunch of points. I already claimed the a couple of them, but let's see. The Temple Spider task gives you, I think, 50 points, and I probably completed something else for 10 points. All right, on the main account, we cannot choose our tasks, so we get some Undead Druids. Wait, those are so hard for me to kill. They're like level 120. I swear I, I did this, didn't I? Uh, wait, can I even skip this? No, I can't. I actually have to do it as well. Let's talk about difficulty of my assignment. See, she doesn't consider my combat level. Fuck me. Um, in the future, please don't give anything too tough, I guess. Alright, so... I think they're... Right, we need more arrows. Let's get more arrows and then we're gonna kill this. Hopefully I can do it with range. I think we did it. All you need is a workshop and eight uh, oak planks. And here we can get an amulet mold. A necklace mold, ring mold, holy si symbol, tiara, and a bracelet mold. We just take all of them. Right, nice, that's all I needed. Okay, let's go make ourselves an amulet of power and a ring of life for the clues roll. First, we create a diamond ring. I made two. Yebemti sunt sejarku. I just made two accidentally. It's okay, one is gonna be for... for Ah, uh, who did that? I wanted one, man. Okay. We made this. Oh, we're gonna need, like, stuff. Alright, boom. Then we need... Strength Emmy. Then we need... Power Emmy. 
I need 70 crafting. Bro! Okay, we're gonna need to get that from a clue scroll then. Here we go. First things first. Strength amulet. Achieved. Secondly, diamond ring. I mean, ring of life. Achieved. And thirdly, let's get some teleports to Winter Todd if we need them. Very nice, let's get back on the spellbook that is actually useful. And now we're gonna go camp some... Oh fuck, we need to make some iron arrows first actually. I need 52 Slayer to even kill those. <laughs> oh, I'm so mad, dude. What is this bullshit? And we, had un we have undead things to kill, man. Ah, fuck, let's try to do those, I guess. Oh, that's so shit though. What if I just drop this for now? And we just try to complete a medium that doesn't require me to have annoying stuff. Let's just... Dude, we're gonna have one million medium clue scrolls anyways. Let's just let's just go and do that. Fuck it. So currently we sped run about three medium clues. But the two clues that I can't complete when it comes to mediums are both that require me to have items. I'm just not gonna bother going for that right now because I will be getting so many mediums that... Honestly, this just doesn't matter right now. I'm trying to get to five mediums at the moment. Uh, and we're just gonna drop the ones that I can't do. In order to complete this temp, we need adamant plate legs, plate body, and full helm. And we have three medium clue scrolls, and you can actually get all of those items in the clues. So I'm actually gonna open these three right here. Let's see what do we get. Adamant kite shield T, not what we need. Not what we need, and not what we need. Uh, okay, so this one's getting dropped. Rip. Ah, uh, I forgot to record. I ended up getting a master scroll book, and I dropped the clue scroll that had... Uh, that had the Shazian step again. Fuck me. Oh well. Alright, well, guess what clue step we have again. Uh, we need an uh, adamant plate body, full helm, you know the drill. If we click medium, do we get any of those items? No, we don't, so that clue will be dropped. But we also have a hard clue. What do we get from this one? Ooh, ladies and gentlemen. We got a master clue scroll. I actually wonder what these are made of. Like, what? where do I need to go? CIS. Oh yeah, I have to kill the hard stuff, right? I really have shit gear to do it, but I think I could do it, probably. I think I won't bother doing this at the very moment though, but I'll definitely do it at a later date. Alright, let's keep on doing some mediums because my gear is still trash. Here we go again, adamant stuff is needed, therefore we're opening the clue scrolls early. Um, ooh, green body, ooh, bandos cloak! That is huge. That's my best, like, pretty much, I don't know if that's, yeah, I think that's permanently best in slot cloak, actually, on the account. And we get an upgrade to the body about them time, because that was really shit. And we have one more. Uh, do I get some adamant stuff? No, but we get, uh, ah, another body. Yeah, is this good? I mean, I can't really use that, can I? But fire battle stuff, I mean, I guess I can, if I ever need money, I, I, now, I now have things that I can pretty much... I can get money easily. So we're gonna throw these in here and uh, we're gonna drop the clue scroll again. I need the adamant pieces badly again. So we have two more mediums. Let's see what do we get. Nope. And uh, just give me my adamant stuff, man. All right, well, this is dropped and one more. What do we get? Let's do it. All right, so we're gonna be opening this hard right here and then we're gonna go and continue with Slayer. Um, let's see what do we get. Ooh, Bandos Plate Legs again. Nice, Lorons. Those are huge. Ooh, and Rune Pickaxe. I don't have that yet. That's also huge. If you guys remember, we ended up buying Rune X, but Pickaxe I didn't buy yet, and I'm happy that I didn't. So, I've already completed 8 Heart Clues. Let's quickly, before we continue with the task, claim points. I only got 10. Okay, let's, uh, well, this is gonna be the gear that I'll be raging level 120 monsters in. It might not be too easy. Alright, I'll be honest, I thought I'm gonna be struggling with this, but then I realized that there's an altar right here, I'm killing them right here, I'm praying offensive prayers as much as I want. Dude, this is kinda nice, but my gear is shit though, so we're gonna be here for a very long time, but I'm chilling, it's fine. Nobody told me that this dropped 29 nature runes? Hello? Okay, that is so good actually. Okay, I'll be ending the trip here. Uh, we got to 63 range. I'll be able to do it when I have enough arrows. But for now, let's actually focus on getting more points. We need 890 points. I think Tithe Farm is honestly what I have to do next. So let's go ahead and do some Tithe Farm and get a bunch of points. Alright, so we are 59 farming. Um, let's see how much XP we get again. 
Should be about 100k, 105k. We have 104 points, which could be enough for me to buy a can, I think. And the farming level is now 63. We're gonna definitely have to do a couple of more runs. But firstly, we should be able to afford the first reward, maybe. Ah, oh, fuck, never mind. I need 100 more. Anyways, I should get like 50 points for completing that. There it is, and we need to keep going. Ah, I don't like this place, man. I can't be asked, dude, but I have to do it. I have to get to 82, else I'm literally a loser, man. So let's just keep, keep fucking farming. All right, change of plan. Apparently, Wook's got the farmer outfit, so therefore, we're gonna get a farmer outfit, and uh, we're gonna start off with the farmer hat. I swear if I got fucked by my Twitch chat, I'm gonna be very, very angry. But at least I look like a beast, so I'm happy. Here we go, another run. It usually takes about 20 minutes to complete these and should get about 105k experience. 106k experience, the hat is helping. What's the level? The level is 66, so we gained three levels there. Oh, I'm gonna have to do a lot of these. God damn, alright. Alright, so it's getting pretty late at night, so I'm kind of tired of doing uh, farming right now, so I'm just gonna buy the boots right here. So that's gonna be the second piece of the full outfit, and it's also the piece that, well, I basically don't have. I look like an absolute champion right now. And while I'm watching some movies, because it's late at night, we're gonna go ahead and mine some iron, and hopefully, well, in the process, obviously, um, get ourselves enough iron to then make enough arrows, to then be able to complete the task, get 70 range, all that sort of thing. So let's just go get uh, get mining a little bit. 50 mining, that is enough for now, we're gonna go ahead and get enough arrow shafts, then put the feathers on those, and then make iron arrows, so, uh, yeah, not bad, 13, 38 total, fuck, I missed the lead level, it's okay, where the fuck, where am I running to? Alright, I guess I'm going this way, that's fine, alright, so, I just, uh, yeah, I'll have to smelt a bunch of iron, I'll only get half of it back, and, uh, I could make rings of forging, but who wants to do those? Um, how much oak do I have? Let's see. I have uh, probably enough to make a bunch of shafts. It's fine. Ah, uh, there we have it. 50 smithing, just making arrow tips. And honestly, we're probably gonna get to like 70 fletching, I'd say. Maybe not really uh, fletching all of these. Unfortunately, you don't really get um, any points for reaching 50, so this is kind of useless. But you know, eventually we're gonna get this to 60 and it's all gonna be fine. I still have like over a hundred bars that I need to make into arrow tips and that's gonna be probably about two, three, maybe four thousand iron arrows that we're gonna be throwing on undead, um, what, what are they, undead druids, I think. It has been a while since I last updated you guys on our AFK account and ladies and gentlemen, the stats are looking quite high. I've been AFKing sand crabs the entire day while I've been playing on our main account and we are just a couple of hits away from 95 attack. So obviously as tomorrow comes, we should be expecting 99 attack and then there's only defense left to go. And then at that point, we literally just start looking for the gear upgrades for the account pretty much. Um, very happy with the progress, even on this guy, even if I'm just killing sand crabs, having these stats and being combat level 109, trust me, if you look at the high scores, high scores, there's not many 109 combats out there, if any. Uh, with that being said though, we are still making arrow tips on our main account. I just achieved 46 Slayer and with that level we got 1350 total, which is quite huge actually. Um, very nice. Unfortunately, ladies and gentlemen, it is that time of the day where I have to say goodbye, but do not worry because I am gonna be uploading another video tomorrow at exactly the same time. With all that being said though, I really do hope you guys did enjoy, and if you did, a simple like would be insanely appreciated, and also if for some reason you're not subscribed, because by the way, 75% of the people that watch the videos actually isn't subscribed, consider doing so, you help me out greatly. And also, very quickly before we end, the stats on our main account are on the screen right now, and the stats of our alt account are on the screen right now. We are actually the highest combat level in the game with 109 at the time of recording this clip, 
So that is kind of insane if you ask me, I'm very proud of that. Obviously, I've just been AFKing, but I've been AFKing many, many hours, so... Yes, anyways, I'm pretty excited to start playing on that account as well. I have some nice plans for on it as well, but first I need to reach the point where I get two times XP Relic on our main account. But that is all for tomorrow, thank you very much for watching, I'll see you again very soon, and have a beautiful day, beautiful night, whatever it is. Have it, uh, have it, uh, have it uh, nicely. Good. Good. <laughs> I'm tired, dude. I'm going to bed. Good night, boys. Bye-bye.